Daniel Aliyi, a young certified software engineer, astute entrepreneur, and emerging industry captain, is the founder and chief executive officer of IAF Sawi Limited, a fast growing ICT company in Nigeria, and indeed one of the most distinguished CEOs to look up to in 2024. I have started, started with uh, about six uh, young guys that uh, had different experience. So we had various experience. One of the co-founders cool happened to have worked in a Chevron at some point. Then one of us also had happened to work in Assets Bank. Then, then I was, I just left school not too long. I, I finished from the University of Lagos. And uh, I had already started work, uh, programming things, building software. I'm actually a software engineer aside uh, doing managing. Uh, if I'm actually both the CEO and the head of engineering, or you can say CTO. So over the years, I've built myself in that aspect, in, web, in software engineering and development. So we started about six of us, and then we, we came together, we pulled our resources together, we rented a place where we were both living and working because we wanted to save costs. So what we did was, okay, why don't we, we're all young, 20 something, we're not married. So let's leave our work. So we had about three, uh, two rooms with a parlor. So, uh, so at that time we were saving costs on rent. So we, we, we would stay there, we'd walk, we would pass the night, then we'd wake up the next day, we kept on working. So that was how we started. So it was a bit rough, but the interesting thing is we're all passionate. We wanted to make a difference because in the edutech day, uh, there were little solutions out there. I mean, then what you would see majorly are paper-based solutions, things like paper pass question, textbooks. So the educational industry was not really making speedy progress at that time. So we wanted to pioneer or make some a difference in that space. So that was how we started. And ever since, we've been making a lot of headway and it has been great since then. The goal we had then was, how can we digitize learning? That was the foundation of our of whatever I wanted to do. So we said, how we have several solutions out there, but most of them are not digital. So how can we digitize learning? So that was the first goal. The second goal is, how can we make learning fun? Because the, the usual way people learn is not fun, like you're just so boring and all of that. So the thought is, how can we create specialized software that would make a difference? So what we mean by that is, aside just learning and taking questions, can we also build things like math solvers, something that can you can actually type your question and get instant solution? So the, go, the, the, the benefit of that is, you are going beyond just providing static information. You are now going beyond that by providing dynamic information, dynamic information that is they are created based on user's request. So if I ask a system, solve this problem, the solution is not being pulled from a database. The system is thinking about the problem and preferring solution. So building such a system would go a long way because a lot of students can actually, will be able to get solutions to their problem instantly without having to look for a teacher and all of that. So these are the three, these are the three goals we, we thought about. So first is digitize education. Second is to make sure that education, learning is fun. Then third is to provide specialized tools, or you can call them innovative tools that would make learning dynamic, not just static, pulling information from a database, like you are creating or synthesizing uh, responses. So these were the three goals we had. And regarding the mission, our goal is to just, as I said earlier, but let me just present in a more formalized way, is to make learning fun, but in such a way that students will be able to pass their exams uh, very, very well. My name is Mimi Kamsiya Chukun Kekinyar. In this year, 2023, 139 students from Deeper Life High School Mole, which is my school, took the UTME and 46 of us came out with 300 and above out of 400 marks in total. I'm just honored to be the top scorer and I'm grateful to the Test Driller team for presenting me with this gift of 100,000 Naira. If you're a Jambite, this Test Driller app 